Hey guys, today we're talking about the Files app in iOS 11, more specifically the third-party options in the app. So in the Files app here, you can see I have iCloud Drive on the left, but I also have a third-party app called Documents. This is on the App Store, it's called Documents 6. And if I click on it, you can see there isn't anything in the folder, uh, which might lead you to believe that it doesn't work on the iOS 11 beta. Uh, but here in this video, I'm gonna show you how you actually can get some third-party apps to work. So you do need to have the app installed on your device. It can't be like a, uh, just a website, like Dropbox, those aren't working yet. So as you can see here, if I open up document six and I wanna go download a video, I'm just gonna uh, go here and download a YouTube video from this website here. So if I just go ahead and paste in this YouTube link right here, and then click the go button. You can see here, I just click the green download button and then it'll start downloading inside the third party app. Now usually uh, in like iOS 10, this would be the only app that you could access this file from. But in iOS 11, Apple wants to simplify this. So if I go to the downloads folder inside the actual application, you can see that, that video file is there. And before, like I said, that would be the only way that you could access this video file. But now if I go to the files app and I click on documents, you can see there that now within this third party link in the files app, I now have access to the downloads folder. And if I click on it, I now have access to play that video. So Apple really wants to create a unified hub for all of your stuff. And uh, later on when it starts working with uh, online services like Dropbox and stuff, it really is gonna be a more powerful uh, file browser than it was before on iOS 10. So guys, that does it for me. That was just a really quick look at the third party options in the Files app in iOS 11. Uh, if you're wondering, my iPad Pro 10.5 is running uh, iOS 11 beta four in this video. So if you wanna go ahead and try it out, uh, I am on the latest beta. Anyway, thank you for watching. My name is Mike and I'll see you in the next video.